YouTube, what goes on? Welcome to Disavowed Action Figures Toy episode number 196. Yes, we are on the long road here to 4,000 subscribers, as well as our 200th hunt episode here on the channel. Uh, what are we looking for? I don't know. I heard there's some AEW clearance popping up, uh, new Marvel Legends, uh, Black Panther. Uh, who knows what we're going to find in this store. But before we get to any of that, please consider hitting that subscribe button. It is free for you. It doesn't cost you anything. Helps us grow the channel tremendously. You'd be shocked how many people watch these videos that aren't subscribed. It's free. Help us out. Hit that button, please. Hit that bell for notifications. That way that uh, bell will actually notify you and tell you uh, when we post new content on the channel, like our weekly toy ends, reviews, and live streams. Leave a comment down below. Hit that like button. And for daily toy content and daily toy updates, just on Instagram and Twitter, disavowed underscore 12. Let's see what they have inside. All right, so back here at Cedar Crest Boulevard Target, uh, taking a look at the DC stuff. Looks like we finally have that on a sale. They're finally clearing those out, or at least not really clearing them out, but have a sales price. So Robin's there, Joker's there. Uh, plenty of gold label stuff. There's a Hush, DC Page Punchers Batman, down here G.I. Joe, all the, uh, all that different Super 7 stuff, Legends. Looks like we still have a pretty healthy dose of the Ned and Peters. Those might eventually actually go to clearance, I'm starting to wonder. Uh, down here, lots of the controller wave also. Those dedicated cases sitting around. Full price on those still, I don't know why. <laughs> Back behind, I did grab this. I wanna go scan it and see if it's down to like $11 or anything. Uh, but plenty of Jeff Hardy, plenty of Macho Man here. Uh, Keebler, I picked that up for 11 bucks on one of the last haunts, much if I told you that or not. Uh, Mando stacked up here as well for a very ridiculous high price. Uh, up top, we do have uh, Black Series, the Dark Troopers. They're actually starting to thin out, so people are picking those up. Uh, wrestling otherwise, Molly Holly, Bailey Kane. Star Trek is kind of crammed in here. Wrestling end cap, what you see right there is what you get. Lots of uh, Seth Rollins. Uh, down below, uh, we have plenty of the buckets, the helmets are down there. Um, again, look cool. Not something I'm going to be collecting. It's a little bit pricey to me. Uh, Motu Land. Do have King Grayskull still here. Princess of Power is sitting there. She-Ra. Uh, some of the stuff from Avatar is still hanging tight from the last time we were here. Uh, Jurassic Park stuff. And just to show you, Transformers collectors. I know I told you I tried to do a better job. Um, that's what you got for Transformers. Again, to me, it looks like there's not a lot of turnaround in this aisle with this stuff. But yeah, full circle back to it let's go take a walk over check the deck section and see what we can find in this store. earlier uh if you are looking for the black panther uh riri williams uh they are here the iron hearts are here they're kind of like crammed back on this random weird end cap all this different stuff but there's a bunch of them here uh there's quite a few so i don't think they're going anywhere anytime soon otherwise this is kind of like uh, role play stuff that deal still going on looks like but uh this is all your your black panther product over in the clearance section, tons of the Series 15. It's amazing when these things first come out, they're so hard to find. And then they're everywhere and they're clearance. It just happens that way, right? Kane, Luger, Xbox crime back there as well. Uh, but here's the thing. $10.99 for a chase. I've really gotten out of elites. I never really was too into them to begin with, but I've just not really done much collecting. But of them but man a 1099 chase i don't think i can leave that behind for 1099 that's just a good price for a chase figure and again it's the orange versus the black also have the nwo shirt there um man i just feel like it's gonna make me want to go and get the entire wolf pack which is not good um i don't know maybe we'll grab it and i'm sure i can find a friend who would be appreciative of having this in their collection at that price so all right that's a big decision to make down here 689 those are all still here Peg Warman uh, down here. Looks like we're down to 1249. Um, that might even be less for Superwoman at this point. I'm not even going to scan it because I just don't really care. But uh, okay, let's go check NECA. Over here at collectibles and the NECA section. Looks like not much change from the last time I was here. Biggest thing I'm looking for now will be those uh, Killer Clown from Outer Space, Toonie Tears. Uh, turtles stacking up a little bit down below. Sunman 3 pack definitely stacking up. There's more over there as you can see. Uh, Bob Ross is back in stock. That's crazy. They brought him back. Uh, but yeah, no Toonie Terrors for me. Nothing new. Uh, every year I say I'm going to buy the Grady Twins and I never do. <laughs> but all right, that's it for us. Let's go pay for this Luger and get out of here. Okay, Airport Road Target. Pretty much the same except they had to have the Dominic Mysterio. There's a chase once again. It's not marked as clearance. Maybe it is. Who knows? Maybe I'll check that out. Uh, four Machos, Jurassic Park, Mo2. Oh, and the Sammies are here. Uh, I heard these are popping up on clearance uh, in weird places, so I'll scan it. If it's not, 
I'm not going to show you. So if you don't see it again, that means it was not on clearance. Uh, spin move back here. GI Joe, pretty bare. We still have some of these laying around. I did notice they do have the plastic free packaging sticker right there. Uh, multiverse down this way. GI Joe dumpster fire for GI Joe. Uh, Joker on clearance there. Sale, I guess, here as well. This is cool. Gold label Batman animated. I wonder what they charge for this guy. 30th anniversary. It's a big boy right there. So, looks pretty cool. Of course, you have that trademark car, trading card in the back. Um, where's a button? Okay. Backlighting. It's actually pretty cool. I haven't uh, seen this before, I don't think. Um, it's probably some stupid price. Uh, but, uh, yeah. I guess if you want a dial piece or whatever, it's not too bad. Back behind. Good look at it there. So, yeah. Okay. I can see some McFarlane uh, using the electronics here. Shout out to Dark Jokers in. Dante, I know you love yourself for McFarlane. So, Toddy Mac, he's got your gold label Batman right here. <laughs> uh, but I think that's about it here, unfortunately. Marvel Legends is just what we've been seeing, basically. Little guys, still regular price. I'd love to get this like five bucks. Uh, but, okay, I think it's time to uh, get out of here and go hit another location. See what All right, find. so stopped at Ollie's over here on uh, Tillman Street. This is crazy. <laughs> X-Men. Uh, Apocalypse, Sage of Apocalypse, out of nowhere. There's a whole case of them here. Two, four, six, eight. 1999. I mean, I've had this forever now, but you still need it. That's not a bad price for it here. So, yeah, all these good stuff. Cheap. All right, so back at the home base and last hunt, we saw all the Baronesses uh, that are still here. <laughs> they, that was uh, a couple days ago. Uh, but we have a full peg here of the Lady J. So it's cool finally seeing these in stores. Can't believe those are still here at full price. It's unbelievable. Uh, but that is a lot of Lady J going on right there. So one, two, three, four, five, seven Lady J's. That's a lot. Um, other than that, and of course, Baroness still being here, which I am, I'm not going to get these. I said before, I love the card art. I actually bought the Walmart three, three quarter when they had them here. So I do have kind of like the little mini cards, like the originals. Um, but yeah, for me, I'm going to pass on those down this way. Marvel Legends, not too much going on, unfortunately. DC Multiverse. Looks like Lobo and some older stuff. Well, again, not older, but not new. Uh, Grifter is there. Spin move back behind. Wrestling. Mo2, not much of a change. No new wrestling. Um, they did find an Orange Cassidy apparently somewhere because <laughs> he was not here yesterday. I was tucked away. New Ray Mysterio's here. Get that top picks, I think. Yeah, new top pick with him. Cena, Series 95 is here. So um, he's, I guess he's here. Big E, I think I saw here. Yep, there's Big E for 95. Uh, the rest looks to be top picks in the back. So not a lot of 95 is here. Superstars. Shawn Michaels is still here. Uh, and I'll show you Transformers. Usually don't do that here at the home base. But there's Transformers action if you were curious what they had. Uh, all right, let's get out of here. Sorry, guys. I'm leaving you two ladies behind. All right, so stop back here at the home base. And we have Nyla still here. But we have restock and Adam Page. But we also have another CM Punk here. So... Always fun finding another CM Punk uh, out here in the wild. So that's here. And back behind, looks like Marvel Legends is still a dumpster fire. I don't see the new wave here for Black Panther as of yet. Um, we get some stacking going on with things here. I'm not going to get involved with going back behind that. So uh, these are just sitting. Those Joes are just sitting around. Nobody is pouncing on those. Those might make it the clearance, assuming they clear them because... They never cleared really any G.I. Joe's, so maybe that will not happen. Um, do I dare try to reach back there? <laughs> I don't see... I see it's old, the old Black Panther. Uh, the old Legacy wave going on. But, uh, yeah, that looks to be about it for today. But pretty cool to see another CM Punk. Looks like there's more Transformer stuff put out. Let me know in the comments because you guys know I don't Transformer. I can't transform. Uh, DC Multiverse down below. Looks like older stuff we've seen before. And yeah, that seems to be about it for here. So I think we're gonna run out. This is just a quick lunch hunt. So thought I'd show you what I found. Uh, yeah, okay, let's get on out of here. And what do we say, everybody? Keep your head on a swivel because look what I just found sitting over here at freaking Walmart. And the cards are bent. I don't think I need this, but it's really cool to see it here. See in hand, it looks a lot better than I expected it to. But I don't have the other lizard. Uh, this is tempting. I it's tempting. I'll leave, leave it at that. Uh, but let's just see here if there's any other Black Panther stuff other than what you're looking at, like the actual Marvel Legends wave, and I don't see that out. So it appears that we just have this randomly thrown here, but uh, it's definitely awesome to see here. 
Uh, yeah, so check your Walmarts, people, because this is apparently hitting. Uh, and I think I just showed the barcode, but if I didn't, here it is right there. So, yeah, barcode, boom. And it's like a weird end cap. So you can see we have Wakanda Forever, Black Panther, Spider-Man stuff. So this just popped up. All right, guys, I'm out here next stop. And a quick stop back here in Cedar Crest and check this out. Unmatched uh, is hitting Cedar Crest Boulevard here in Allentown. So here is Unmatched Series 4, but Series 5 is here. And the freaking Cody Supreme is here. So they are stocked with these Supremes. You have a Cody, a Brit, a Brit, another Cody, another Brit. So it looks like a full case of those. Um, I definitely don't need another Sammy in my collection. But I think it's cool that they did sculpt this uh, inmate costume. So, or I should say outfit. So I guess we're getting, or gear is the best word, I guess. So I'm guessing we're going to eventually get the entire uh, Jericho Appreciation Society. Or I guess it would actually be uh, Inner Circle uh, as their ring attire from i think that was uh blood and guts let me know in the comments if i'm wrong um i don't need that i'll leave that here uh also we do have hangman adam page here from series four so definitely restock uh actually first one price thing stocked on the unmatched um and the supremes so if you're looking for cody there is the barcode on cody and if you're looking for these here's the barcode uh, on the sammy if that helps you at all other than that wdb seems pretty typical stuff looks like we have some basics uh macho is still here Mando pretty pegged up. He's still here. Three and three quarter. Obviously, we still have our Dark Trooper back behind DC. Just sees what you get. Nothing too crazy. Stuff that's been here before. Uh, Transformers. This is that section going on here. Uh, but that seems to be about it here uh, from Cedar Crest. So I think we're going to call Hunt everybody. So if you're new, please consider hitting that subscribe button. It is free for you. It doesn't cost you anything. It helps us grow the channel tremendously. I hit the bell for that bell for notifications. That way, YouTube will actually tell you. When we post new content on the channel, like our weekly toy hunts, reviews, and live streams, leave a comment down below, hit that like button. For daily toy content and daily toy updates, check us over on Instagram and Twitter at disavowed underscore 12. Hey everybody, if you're only toy hunting this week, remember the three P's of the toy hunt. Patience, persistence, most of all, politeness. Take care, stay healthy. I'll be seeing all of you at the pegs.